Trade Talk Showcase on Brownfield. I'm Amy Simpson, and we're here today with Stephanie Zelenko with AgroLiquid. So to start off, um, some of the things you're talking about is crop nutrition options for growers and, and why that's so important. Tell me a little bit about that. So crop nutrition is you know, very critical just so we can make sure we, number one, achieve top yield, and number two, do that economically. When we're looking at building that fertility program for the upcoming growing season, we always start with a soil test. So that's where we're gonna look at you know, the details of what we need to help make those best management decisions. And uh, you just mentioned soil testing. I know that that's something that's really important. Um, most groups, I actually don't know, maybe most growers don't do it, but why is that something that if they aren't doing it, they should consider doing it? Soil testing um, is becoming more critical. You know, it's always been very important, but now the economics come into a little bit more play and we're becoming better agronomists as growers, we realize how important it is to actually get those soil tests. And so as time has passed, you know, I've been with the company and in the industry for over 20 years. At that point in time, people were soil testing every five years or so. And now we have guys that will soil test every year or every other year. So they realize the importance of that, of learning what's in their soil. That's gonna just help their crop grow better and help them spend their dollars more efficiently. And why is that something that's so important, you know, especially this year, but in previous years too, to make sure that they have what they need to be efficient and be the most successful? A lot of times, you know, when we think of crop production, we were thinking just nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium, that NPK end of things. But there's so many more nutrients that are in the soil, all the secondary micronutrients, and those things are just as important to grow a crop as the nitrogen and phosphorus components are. And so, you know, as we're looking at those soil tests, we can look at those individual things and those nutrients and help build that complete program instead of just focusing on those big nutrients. And that's a lot of times where we're going to get that extra yield come the end of the year is if you're addressing all those other micronutrients and secondary nutrients along with the big three. And what are some innovations in crop nutrition technologies? You know, what are some of those that we've seen? Fertilizer has changed a lot over the last few years. We're looking at products that are more efficient and that's where agroliquid falls in. We're looking at ways to make those nutrients more usable to the crop, safer, that way they're able to use more of the nutrients that are applied. Again, you know, saving those growers dollars so we can, you know, more effectively use the money that we're spending in crop nutrition. And so by having more effective products and looking at all of the nutrients, just not N, P, and K, you know, allows that grower to you know, better build that program and better build his cropping system. And if people want to know more about those things that uh, we've been talking about or agroliquid in general, where's a good place to send them for more information? So AgroLiquid has a whole trained uh, staff of agronomists and sales account managers. All that information can be found on our website, agroliquid.com. Uh, you can contact any of our employees. We also have a research website portion of that. So you can look at all the data and all the information that we've done over the past 30 years. And uh, anything else you wanna add in about uh, crop nutrition tests, soil testing, anything like that, anything we didn't cover? I guess one last comment is, you know, working with the right people that have the right products is going to help make your, your fertility program and your crop, you know, reach its best and fullest potential. And so, you know, check out at Liquid and see what we have to offer and contact some of our, our representatives. Sure. Great advice. And that was Stephanie Zelenko with AgroLiquid. I'm Amy Simpson with Brownfield Ag News.